yes, this is how we roll. You know what time it is. Yes. It's just the right moment for you to leave off whatever you're doing mm -hmm. and let's have some fun together. Come on. You know, <laughs> the first case it is taking a toll yes, on everybody it is. and this is just oh. where to relieve all those stress. Mm, yes, but not to worry, Metrofile is here and yeah. we are to calm you down, mm -hmm. remove all the stress you had during the week. Exactly. The stress, like you <laughs> said, but it's going to be an interesting package. We Definitely. hope trust us to serve you the details. But before then, this is to our sensitive viewers. Remember, some of the images you might be seeing on the show today might just contain flash photography. But don't worry, just calm down yeah, and enjoy this. Be a great time. I am Anne Uwawadu. <laughs> and I'm Mogi Chikuo, so thank you so much for joining us. Now, we all just love weddings, don't we? And that is why we are going to start off with one, and that's the wedding between Enobong Essien and Ofonime Johnson, and the two-day event held in Akwaibom and Cross River State. Enjoy. The venue is set, and the day started off bright and early, bringing all good tidings to the Essien and Johnson families giving out the hand of their children, Enobong Esien and Ofonime Johnson in marriage. Have you seen my tomato, baby? Oh. The groom's family are in the house of the Esiens in Eket, Akwaibom State, South-South Nigeria, to seek the hand of their daughter in marriage. And to begin the event proper, this Akwaibom dance troupe ushered in the parents of the bride, Dr. and Mrs. Joseph Esien. The bride's mother, Mrs. Teresa Isien, a veteran broadcaster, was the former controller programs and presentation in Channels Television and presently the general manager of the Cross River State Broadcasting Corporation. The groom, Afonime Johnson, a civil engineer, took the spotlight as he made his grand entry led by his friends. He took his seat as he awaited the arrival of his bride in Obong Isien, a microbiologist, as she is led in by her maid of honor. And then, the marriage rites were performed in line with the tradition of the Eket people. is then officially handed over to her in-laws, now her new family, to seal the union. 
Enobong is a microbiology graduate from Caleb University, Lagos, and holds a master's degree in environmental microbiology from the Federal University of Aberdeen, while the groom of Wanime is a civil engineer graduate from the Federal University of Technology, Oweri, in Imo State. The two then jointly cut the traditional cake, their first duty as a couple together. I'm extremely happy. When I went into her, I realized that this is actually the woman I needed. She accommodates, she makes you laugh, she makes you feel fine. In fact, all in one. It's a good thing for us to add another person to the family in a right way and in a respectful way. So I pray God to grant them fruitful marriage and long life and prosperity. I am pretty sure she's going to live the kind of lifestyle that will live me and her mother because uh, they have lived all, uh, she has lived all her life with us and she has never for one day watched us quarrel, me and her mother. I'm so excited that God has honored me this way. You know, as a mother, you attend weddings all the time and you hope that one day your daughter will also pass through this process. And uh, here, it, we're going through that process here today. The celebration did not end here. It continued days later at St. Peter's Catholic Church, Ediba, Calaba, Cross River State. The maid of honor heralded the arrival of the bride, led in by her father, Dr. Joseph Essien. journey for the couple started in 2014 and they both are indeed glad that their dream has become reality and with everyone here standing as witnesses, the couple took their vows and exchanged rings. certainly called for Thanksgiving. With the Thanksgiving, the service ended and reception kicked off right away. And the latest couple danced in happily. And 
the mothers of the day also have their time. And then another cake to cut, this time an exquisite one. Then this sealed it with a kiss, followed by a toast to a new life together. The occasion was rounded off on the dance floor. This is a journey they both started together and here's wishing them marital bliss.